Hey there, it's me. <clears throat> Good morning. It's Gritzy. Welcome back to Orwell or whatever. Do you have any idea how long this takes to load for some reason? I lost patience and started doing my intro while it was still loading. And it's just, it's still... Hey, there we are. Welcome back. Um, Jeez, uh, what was I in the middle of last time? Yeah, so this is the... Uh, yeah, you probably weren't expecting this, but this is actually a series. Let me, uh... Let me turn it, turn it down a little bit here. Turn it, turn it, turn it down a little bit. There's, uh... There's a little... There's a little just a little turn it down there. <clears throat> yeah, you probably weren't expecting this, but... Orwell is an actual series now. I really loved the game, and I really did want to play it. So there's first ever Critsy Bear actual series that isn't <coughs> isn't Cataclysm or uh, Dwarf Fortress, at least in this iteration. So welcome back, welcome back to Orwell. Last time we left off, we were investigating Robin Vart and Oleg Bakay, trying to figure out what the fuck happens, and why Oleg is in like Romania or something. I don't know what the actual country is in the game but yeah it does have kind of a central European uh, feel kind of like you know where they were uh, yeah <clears throat> welcome back <laughs> uh, so did I already investigate everything here or uh, oh uh. I missed through this chat. Uh, I fear my cover might have been blown. Uh, I'm gonna leave that one because that's warning the office, and I don't think he's warning the office. Um, new portrait, don't need that shit. Um, here's Oleg and Robin. No, Oleg and the president of that dude has been talking to the president directly. <coughs> And there's his rugby team. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, I was suggested though to um, go and absorb the information that was um, Robin being the president. Uh, our president, no principal of the school before, right? Because there was that school that exploded. Now, I can't, I can't remember what went on, but you know that's that's kind of suspicious. Yeah, related document found. Cool. <clears throat> well, that might explain his preachy attitude. She says, "All right." Please forgive me, I'm just waking up. Uh, what did we find? Uh, secondary school. Just secondary school. Not labeled anything, just secondary school. Let me minimize all these things. This is getting on my nerves. Uh, it makes things tidy. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Let's see. 2010, that's seven years ago. Latest news reports have stated that the troops and terrorist group FTP are getting closer to Prava, which may make parents raise concerns in parents about sending their children to school. Therefore, we uh, ensure the safety of pupils and teachers. The school administration has requested protection from the Pargesian army. Hmm, I might include that little bit of information. Uh, despite the situation remaining tense, our beloved community of Brava, Mr. Vart is said to keep the lessons going and is determined to pe provide ongoing education to our students. We ensure that our children's safety at Reva Community School, says the principal. Education is one of the highest valued assets that we have. Yep. And what's this one? <clears throat> Due to events related to the war, school administration has now decided to provide a protective hideout from combat activities by upgrading our library. Hey, we've seen pictures of that, dude. Hey, related uh, related document. Seems a bit overprotective if you ask me, but then again, 
Yep. Cool. Oh, shoot. That had a lot of updates. Um. Oh, boy. An unsung hero that you need to know about. Oh, no. My brother is a hero, and this stuff. Oh, shoot. I forgot to look at the freaking draft. Oh, god dang it, dummy. Oh, well. My brother is a hero, and this article will prove it to you. We have not been maintaining this blog for a while. Uh, I'd like to, I'd now like to renew it by telling the story. The story of an unsung hero that you simply need to know about. The uh, story is a person who never got the credit he deserves, which I will now change. And this It is the story of my brother Robin, who wrote most of the previous articles on this blog. Robin told you about our long, troublesome her journey from Hargay to the nation. Now we have to live in refugee camp for an inhumanely long time under terrible conditions. And about why we have to leave our beloved country... Robin is not a man who likes to share his personal stories. This incident finally forced us... Wait. But I have decided, uh, especially if you're a reader from our home country, Parge, you know, you ought to know this about my brother. The incident uh, that finally forced us to leave Parge was a tragedy, especially in the eyes of my brother. Brava Secondary, the school that Robin was teaching at, and had, in fact, helped to build with his own two hands, was bombed to the ground. A place of learning, a place of safety, a place that Robin had always offered the Pargesian children the opportunity of a good education was nothing more than a smoldering rubble. <coughs> See, that's what I'm talking about. During the bombings, most of the children from Robin's sixth grade class had been trapped in the school garden shed, as they had not been able to make it to the safety of the library, which they had been using for a bomb shelter. Against what everyone told them, Robin ran out of the shed and saved those children from certain death and a hellish attack. He did not rest until every one of them was safe in the library. Without, a brave, without his brave escort, they never would have made it to the shelter where they were able to wait in safety until the bombing was finally over. The shed was destroyed only minutes later, but Robin himself, he had not made it safely back before the bombs dropped. He was buried under the rubble for almost a day, clinging to his bare life until finally discover we finally discovered him. But he had paid a high price, his ability to walk. I cannot tell you how much I admire my brother. Uh, so much bravery, and though, although I was uh, never permitted me to write this article, I've decided that you, dear readers, simply needed to know about this. Cool. Alright, that's pretty inspirational. I mean, I don't know how true it is, because this is coming from his brother, who obviously is biased, but... Uh, saved lives of students from an attack on his school. Uh, I'll keep that in mind, but I'm gonna go investigate other things, like news here. Latest news reports have stated that the troops of Territorial Group FTP are getting closer to Bravo, which uh, made many parents raise concerns about sp sending their children to school. Oh, wait, wrong, wrong one. Dummy. Uh, what am I looking for here? There's a link I. Ah! I didn't lose these links. Ah! It's Robin Bart, here's Christiana, Andre Chuckle-Cluck. Nika Chagrangurga. So this would just tell me what subjects he, he majored in. Nah. <coughs> mission as yeah, just a school's mission. Oh, I got a hiccup sound. Oh, sorry. Reactions to what? Ah, just more. Never would I have thought you'd go this far. I've always knew you were crazy. But kidnapping a soldier just to get some PR for your dumb blog is completely mad. Uh, I have reason to believe he was involved in this horrid attack on my school back in 2010. Woo! <clears throat> I know that he was one of the people in charge during the Prava school attack, since knowing what would happen, he did not let his daughter attend that day. That's pretty suspicious. That's pretty suspicious. Alright, and what are we missing here? There's another link. Um, ooh. Ooh. Ooh! Alright, alright, I got it. I got it, I got it, dude. Um. 
This is a record of attendance for Radka. Can I just do first name? Or does it gotta be whole name? Shoot. Come on. Um, may oh wait, it, it lets me do the name. Oh, come on! Oh, I wanted to prove that. Red Cup of K. Red Cup of K. Oh. Or, you know, there's just no record of her attending the school. <coughs> oh, date! Okay, okay, okay. Um. Okay, I, I, I was freaking missing out on an important detail there. Um, can I, like, type? Nope, of course not. Uh, called to take the streets of... Nope. Um, move on. When was the bombing? I'm just looking for dates. God dang it. I don't have a date for it. <clears throat> All I know is that it happened. Alright, well, I'll keep that. So, now I have to find what that information conflicts with there. Ooh, okay, maybe, uh... Maybe if I find the information for the date, then I can see, and maybe she actually was there. Maybe Robin here is fucking lying. <coughs> Alright, um... Where would I find that, though? 2007... Uh, is it pictures? Rugby, do you got a date on you? No? And there's, uh... Why does Robin have a picture of Oleg meeting with the president, though? Hmm. I guess he was investigating him, too. Uh... Maybe, uh, maybe, maybe, uh, the People's Voice has a date. Hmm. Oh, 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 maybe the uh, hospital records. But, um, date of birth, no. Uh, heck. They recorded, it's it's right. No, because that wouldn't. I, I would love to fucking drag that around. Bart, I want that. Date of birth, no. Date of registration. Um. <clears throat> no, that's not an accurate date. I want. I want when it was. Fuck, dude. I want that day of school. burns again how about this what's the people's voice nope secondary school uh, news 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 how about this mm. nope, not there not gonna give me a date, is it? I, I hope I didn't miss anything. Hmm. 
maybe uh maybe our national news uh has a national beholder nope n literally nothing to drag there all right <clears throat> Let me just go back into school records of attendance, uh, database, insert a date. People's voice. I didn't know that was considered an alias. Called to take the streets on April 12th of 2017. Yeah, I'm definitely not going to get anything for that date. Um, let me check out, uh, he had, like, a picture of, uh, Robin, no, uh, that dude hanging out in the library, right? No. Became, pick a deal. Okay, metal. Cam. Camera. Ah! Wait. Hold on a second here. That's... From today? Robin's in the li- I mean... Uh, uh, Bouquet's in the library? Can't I t t fucking... Oh, come on, dude. I found the K. <laughs> Maybe? Found somebody hanging out in the library. <sighs> That's literally from today. Alright, trash. Token of my appreciation. Already read that. Um, how about, how about this student? <sighs> so are there any dates here? <clears throat> Alright, I guess, uh, there is something, I guess I'll do Vart, Vart, Vart's current residence, maybe, no, cause he married his, he's married to a social worker, so maybe he got entry into the country, into the nation. Hmm. I don't know. Never mind. Let me look up in um our search thing here. Let me look up his alias. Anything? Nah, dang. Verified. <laughs> okay. Oh, dang. Oh, stretch. Ah, oh. Hmm. Do I know anything about these dudes? No, not really. Huh. Who is David Jones? I don't know. I have to drag something somewhere. I'm people's voice. I've got to look at the drafts. Where were the, where were those at? Ah, admin panel. No pending article. Yeah, I I missed my chance to do that. All right. <clears throat> 
shoot, maybe they freaking had something in there that that would have would have not made it to the final draft. God dang it. Dummy 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 doofus. Well, I'm gonna drag that in that he has reason to believe that uh, he was involved on the attack on his school. Upload complete. If he really believes that, that could be a strong motive. Good. We can't solely uh, work solely on what Robin Vart believes, though. We have to. We need to clarify whether there was more hints that Bakay is involved in this. Yep, I know. Just hoping that more shows up if I pass a little time. I need to get investigating Piquet again. I have very little information about him. What can what can I go off of here? We unminimize everything. Janus, uh, am I missing anything here? Borgesian. Uh, Hardly anything. Guard Robin. Okay, registration is that. Berkeley Bricoleaks. This is medical records. Faculty. Nope, oh, probably not. Uh, news. Registration request from Margesian Army. Um. People's voice and yeah. That is not necessary information. I guess sort through everything. People's voice, situation is calm, faculty, just as through there. Okay. Uh, school administration is requested protection. That's the only thing here. Um, faculty. That's literally what I was just looking at. I'm getting confused. Uh, there's medical records we just looked through in there. Bart. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, this is date of registration. We can get there. Um, Janus, we can get his nationality from here. And that's it there. Anything, uh, we have Robin's phone records. Wish I could get Oleg's phone records. Oh. Oh, we do. It's just his also counts as his computer. Okay, well, there's a bunch of things that I don't have here, like there, he believes that, but, uh, philosophy class, yep. Uh, there, I'll upload that. He's been talking to the president. He talked to Cassart directly and didn't inform us. Damn it! I'll have to assume he shows disloyalty towards us, otherwise he would not, he would not have reported that in. Oh, otherwise he would have reported that in. I mean, it, to be fair, it could be before he was part of our thing, and something updated here. What do we have? One more innocent w that will be punished. Uh, it's not up to me to speculate who might have caused these terror attacks, but one thing is certain. The Pargesian people will be blamed, and they're um, the ones who are going to suffer. Especially the ones living in the nation, no matter what their citizenship really is. What hardships they might have suffered themselves already, no matter how many pre prejudices and hate they have already faced in the nation. These are the people who are going to suffer, not the real perpetrators. Alright. Alright, thank you for showing me that. That's a very, very short article, though. I guess maybe gotta wait a little more. Alright, anything else? Anything else here? Uh...
portrait. No. And then there's the rugby team, which I certainly don't need. Fear my cover might have been blown. I still don't think that's him trying to warn the office about him being revealed. I think that's him, like, trying to report to Par Pargesia or something. So, I don't want to go and get false information. Alright, so, that leaves me in the same situation as I was before. I wish I had a date. Because I don't want to... I don't, I don't want to put that in, knowing that it conflicts with something that I can't see yet. I'm sure, I am certain, that if I get the date in there, it's going to show that Bart is blatantly lying about that or something. But I can't get a date for whenever the bombing happened. When was the school bombed, dude? Please give me a little, uh, please give me a little more information. Uh, day that school was bombed. <sighs> How long have I been recording this? Uh, 20 minutes and I've barely made any progress. I'm gonna, I'm, I know that I shouldn't, but I'm probably going to end up uploading something irrelevant because I can't find what I'm looking for. Please give me a date, dude. And I, I guess I can just, like, start putting random dates into it because it won't let me manually type things in. I mean, if I could, I would, like, type in three days before his accident there. But it won't let me manually type it in. Because <laughs> I do know that much. For fuck's sake, dude. There's records of attendance. Let me just... Any old date. Any old date will do. Uh, where are the dates at? I think the only date we have is on Robin. Yep, no record of attendance there. I'm gonna go ahead and just upload his date. Oh no, not his date of birth! God damn it! Uh, that's not what I wanted. His the date of registration. Right after the safety bill came into effect. Bad timing from their point of view, I guess. Right, once more, the innocent will be punished. What do we have here? Anything? Yeah, nothing. Uh, 
Oh, it's a little different. Um, what do they want? <clears throat> what do they want, these terrorists? They want to promote terror. <laughs> to cause public outrage, fear, and social societal unrest. They want to use the people of the nation to live in fear. More specifically, they want us to use this fear. No, they want to use this fear against the people. It is not up to me to speculate who might have caused these terror attacks, but one thing is certain, the Pargesian people will be blamed, and are the ones who are going to suffer, especially the ones living in the nation, no matter what their citizenship status is, what hardships they might have suffered themselves, already from the national exploitation of their own country, no matter how much prejudices they and hate they've already faced in the nation. These are the people who are going to suffer, not the real perpetrators. Welcome to the fair and just developed country where everyone gets what they deserve. Welcome to national justice. Alright. And uh, I guess I have to click on this just so that I have an update. That was written very quickly. He literally wrote that in 20 minutes. I think maybe you should go through a little more, little, little more than that before you, you like go and upload things, alright, records of attendance, um, immigrated to the nation February 6th, how about that? Damn it! God, fuck. <sighs> well, that's two little time slots that I wasted doing that shit. Saved the lives of students from attack on a school. Uh, I don't want to start flooding her with useless information. I don't think she needs to know that he majored in English and philosophy. Uh, school administration has requested Bargazian protection. Do I want to upload that, or... Sure, I guess. Maybe it's related to... Uh, wait. Army protection for a school? Seriously, th this must have been... Things must have been bad. Or somebody must have been really worried. Especially regarding the shelter. Eh, whatever. Yeah, nothing new. Medical record. Anything currently residing in Outer Bantan reception camp. Uh, I guess I'll upload that. What? Still? I doubt that somehow. God damn it! Oh, I'm blowing it. Oh, I'm I'm blowing it. Oh, I'm blowing it. I'm blowing it. Oh, god damn it. Okay. Oh, what? I have something here still. He's in a wheelchair. We don't need to know that. We already know he's paralyzed. Uh... Nothing. Wait, what? Why is it still... Ah, it's another picture. Let me go ahead and disable that. We don't need another picture. This one's fine. Back in my day, we did good with whatever picture we got. Just disable. Just disable. Wait. That is not the date that it shows there. That says May 4th, 1975, and that says May 4th, 1979. You want to explain that to me? Oh, we're missing one. Ah, picture. Disable that. I'm just going to go through and disable things, I guess. Um, you don't need to know that he's in a wheelchair. We don't need to know that he majored in, that, that his subjects are English and philosophy. Oh, wait, a little more. What else do we have here? Ah, picture. No, we don't need a new picture for him. We don't need to know about the harassment. Um, 
mainstream media have been manipulating your thoughts since the dawn of humanity. Time to get rid of this enemy. Don't need to know that. <clears throat> Nation burns again. People's voice in our efforts to get the facts to the people. The situation in the nation has been rather calm. That's probably biased. And... Robin ran out of the shed to save these children. That's probably biased, too. What do we have here? Nothing. Uh, here we have rugby team. Definitely don't need to know about the rugby team. Though you would uh, guess otherwise, considering my freaking history today. With the freaking birthday and the address. Uh, tried to warn the office about supposedly having been revealed. No, that wasn't to the office. I'm disabling that. Unless I need to upload that. Oh, missing things. Literally the only thing here is this. which further paints the picture that Bekay is a traitor. But it could be... It could be untrue. That's the thing. And it won't show me what it conflicts with. But that's the only thing I can find here that's relevant to anything. Except maybe, uh... Where, where was the other one? Except maybe him... Fucking... Trying to warn... People. I mean, I don't think that it's... Him trying to warn the office. I'll drag that in, see if a related document. Nope. He tried to warn us that Vart had compromised him. Why did the ne messages never reach us? There's no way Robin Vart could have obtained the official documents and put them in Perco Leaks. There must be someone else behind it. Oh, come on, dude. Give me a break! Give me a break! Oh. Can I just, like, up upload Robin's entire file to Percoleaks? Can I upload Oleg's profile? No. Of course not. Alright, well... The only thing I can really see that is at all relevant is this. But... I don't know if it's true. And I can't find the thing it conflicts with. Conflicts with one unknown data chunk. I'm certain that it's got to do with the records of attendance. But it won't let me type anything in! Bah! Three things cannot be long hidden. The sun, the moon, and the truth, says Buddha. Alright. Well, my goal is to find a motive. I guess I'll use that as his motive. <sighs> Upload is strongly discouraged. Oh, come on. I don't got anything else. There's nothing else here. That's the only thing. That's the only thing. All these other things. All these other things. What am I missing? Fuck, dude. Alright, since I'm just floundering here, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode, give myself a little while to think about this. Because uh, very little has been done this episode, and I don't want to draw it out even more. You know, I can think on my own time. <coughs> um, bye!
Yeah, have a have a good time. Whatever.